everybody and welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Katrina and this is Cat and Moon Budgets. Today we're just going to be doing a cash stuffing from my paycheck from March 31st. So this is April 1st, so April Fool's Day. And we have snow. Oh, this ring is turning my finger green. Dang it. Okay, well, I was going to wear a ring on my fingers, but it's starting to turn my finger green. So that's awesome. Um, but anyway, so we're going to be cash stuffing this check and I'm counting it towards April because I didn't really have anything coming out the last day of March. And so I figured it should just go towards the April income. So we're just going to start off by counting this and then we'll get to stuffing. So we have 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 400. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 60. I spent some of it. Okay. I was like, why is that like that? I should have more than that. But I spent some of it because I had to go to the store and get the kids some shoes. Um, they really needed new shoes. And so we picked out some really good ones that they wanted. Um, I told Jackson he's going to have to get used to tie shoes because he keeps ripping the Velcro off of his shoes for some reason. Like the strap just keeps coming off. And so I told him he's going to be getting tie shoes this time. And he was okay with that. He found some really cool ones that he liked. So we're going to get started. I'm going to start in the home binder first because I have just one thing to do in there. So I figured that would be the easier one to start with. So we're just going to put 100 for my part of the rent. And then we're going to put 14 in water. And this will be the last time that I'm stuffing it. I probably should have just done this electronically. But um, I did not. So this will be my last water portion for my part of the bill coming up. Because I pay two thirds of it. And then my boyfriend will pay a third of it. Um, just because there's more of us than him. So... We use more water, naturally. Um, that's what we agreed on, and so that's what is going to happen. So we're going to move to my wallet. And I had some rollover from the previous month. I'm going to take my receipt out. Um, so I have 21 in here. And then we're going to put 60 in here. Um, I did the math and 80 just seems to be a good amount to have for the week because I do drive to Stoughton for work. Um, so we have 20, 40, 60, 81. Um, and so that takes up a little bit more gas and I did not fully fill up last time because I only had 22 on my card and I needed more than that. But I started doing festival rewards. So that way... Um, sorry, I have music playing in the background and the song makes me cry. Um, but yeah, I forgot what I was saying. The song distracted me. Um, um, I used some of my toiletry money, so we got 10, 15, and 20 in here instead of 40. Um, and then medical will be getting 40. So we got 20, 30, 35, 40. I really forgot what I was talking to you guys about. I'm so sorry. Um, so yeah, but we went to the store, got the boys some shoes and I got some spring clothes cause they had like a bunch of stuff that was like super cute for pretty cheap. So I got a couple of dresses to try on and see if I like how they fit. I might have to take it back for a size up. Um, impulses is just getting 20. Um, so I might have to just go back for a next size up because it's from the junior section. And I just think the junior clothes are more, are like cuter than the adult clothes. So I just have to buy bigger sizes. So I got a medium cause I wear like medium ish tops, but the dress is kind of stretchy fabric. And so I thought that would be better to have like a smaller size. I don't know. Well, we'll see because a women's eight is like a junior's 
11. So it's like just a size up um, according to the websites. So we'll just see how it goes. I left the tags on and I have the receipt because I save all my receipts for fetch rewards, but we'll see how that works. So we're going to move into our long-term sinking funds and add in 25. I'm just stuffing a little bit less because I do have it built up pretty large for my tax return. So we have 100, 200, 300, 400, 95 in the bank. So we got 50, 1, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 51, 52, 53. I don't remember how much that was, but yeah. That puts me in like almost 900 ranges. That's fine. No, we'll figure that out later. I have a sheet where like I put the running balances on them and stuff. This is getting harder and harder to get the money back in here. Um, I think I need to take what I have in here to the bank because that's just getting way too hard. Um, but I have a running balance in here, and as of the end of March, let me just tell you guys real quick, my Oshitaki fund had $823 in there. So, my car maintenance, I just transferred some money over for my lug months, and I did purchase them right away. So, we got $570 in the bank, and then we're going to add $25. So we have 500, 600, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 700, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90. So we got $790 in the bank. We should. Um, like I said, I got to adjust that because I put, I took some money out. It was about $70 for the lug nuts for my car. Um, with the shipping because I just bought them off of Rock Auto. So that should be good. Disney we're not putting anything into. Runner's insurance we're not. So we're going to go to 4th of July. Um, and that's getting $8. What do you guys even do for 4th of July? Because I really don't know what there is to do besides like fireworks. Um but we typically just do like a little festival. Um, Cause there's a festival near here that does things for children. Um, well, it's for everybody, but apparently I can't talk at the same time. Okay. So there's a festival a couple towns over that has like carnival and then they do fireworks and there's like a bunch of other events and stuff like truck bowls. 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. Um, so that's kind of like what happens in my area for fireworks. And then like 4th of July, there's a parade downtown, I believe. But I don't know what we're going to do this year. I'm just saving up so I have some for it. Christmas is online. Gifts. So I like to be prepared because we have birthdays coming up and I know they're not until like the summertime, but I like to be prepared. 20. So in gifts we have 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. Oh, that was not supposed to get six. That was supposed to get 10. We have 20, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. I was reading the wrong thing. So this will just be in handy. Like if there's a birthday party my kids have, if there is um I don't have office in here. What am I doing? I literally can't multitask right now. Like my brain is just not with it. I don't know what's wrong with it. Um, so we'll just move on to the kids binder. Here it's like really gloomy and it's been snowing all morning. 
and I really just don't know what's going on with the weather. Like, we're supposed to get... Yesterday, it was, like, summer. We literally had um, 60-degree weather, a thunderstorm, and it was supposed to, like, create tornadoes, which I guess it did around us, just not in my actual... Like, in my town. Bentley's birthday is getting 10, so we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94. Um, so, the boys did not sleep last night very well. They were scared. Um, yeah. So, we don't handle storms very well around here. Um, so, what's it like where you guys are? Let me know down below and we can just kind of chit chat over the um weather what category back to school wow i really need to like take a nap or something i think because my brain is just like not operating and i still have to do homework for my class because i want to make sure i get the full points 20 30 40 45 50 55 60 65 66 67 68 69 70 so we are a, almost a third of the way there for back to school. All right, eating out is gonna get 30. So we have 50 in eating out. I don't even know if I listed that one, I should've. I really hope I didn't count wrong. That would be just my luck, too. But I don't have enough denominations. So, beauty is supposed to get 10, so I'm just going to put a 20 in here and call it a day because I don't have the right amount of my denomination somehow. Okay. And then entertainment is going to get 10 as well. Which we don't. And we have one ten. So we have 51 in here. Oh, already. Okay. 2024 birthdays. The sheet does not have the right things listed down. I bet you I did count wrong. All right, we're not going to put anything in here because I don't think I planned on putting anything in here. So I should have just two categories left. I haven't been doing DoorDash. I have 20 in my thingy, so we're going to do student loan. We're going to put 20 in here. So we got 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100. So we're going to do this. We're going to get an index card for now, and we're going to create a little placeholder. And then I will take my student loan money to the bank and put it in my savings account and just label it. So we'll put that off to the side. And then my car loan is going to get 20 as well. 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 100, and 1. I'm going to do the same thing as well and create a little placeholder. I don't have my 100 placeholders printed out. So that's why I'm not using them. But I like that I've already gotten this much saved up to kind of like go towards extra payments to just kind of help pay it down sooner. And then my Wisconsin license repayment, because it's I put it on my credit card in case you missed that. I just charged it to my Indigo card that I paid off, and now I'm just working towards paying it on the um, due date, which is April 19th. So I'm just going to pay off the balance off on that card instead of just like the monthly minimum. I'm just gonna pay off the whole amount of what I charged. I really wanna get in that habit. 
of doing that. So I have $40 left that I did not put in here that I don't know what happened. So I don't think I meant to put this office down as a 20. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. We have $12 left. What the hell did I do? I don't know how this got so messed up, guys. So I guess we're just going to go through here. There's one G book, so that's where that's going to go. I guess we'll just put it in here randomly. So we got a G book. If I can open this, I like squeezed it shut so the money wouldn't come out. We'll put the G book in here. So we got 15 right here plus 20 that I had in the bank or whatever I have. Yeah, 20. So every 20, I'm going to put it in the bank. So that way I can just save them up for in case something goes south and I need it or things like that. Um, I think I'm just going to put the rest of this I think I'm just going to put it in the envelope challenge and call it a day because I really don't want to sit here and figure out what I did wrong I just don't and we haven't been doing the envelope challenge as much as I would like to so Nine, 10, 11, 21, 26. So again, this one got drained, so there's only 26 in here. And I will go through and fix my trackers. But that's all I got for you guys today on this super sloppy, super distracted, ADHD filled cash stuffing for you. But that's what I have. And that's just how my brain works some days. I can't control it. I just have to work with it. So I think I am just going to lay down instead of doing my homework and forcing my brain to do something that I'm not going to comprehend what I'm doing anyway. So I'm just going to lay down, relax for a little bit and see if I can wake my brain up. But I hope you guys have a really great rest of your day and enjoy your start of April. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Oh, um, one thing. I reached 200 subscribers where I think we're at like 209 already or something like that so be sure to put in the comments below what you would like to see for the next giveaway prize and I will start working towards that and um also when you subscribe make sure you watch uh, like a minute or two of a video right away so that way the system doesn't think that you're a bot um that way you guys stick around on my subscriber count that just helps me out so if you would I would really appreciate that so I will catch you guys in the next video. Bye.